Hey everybody, Chad Wesley Smith here to take you through a uh, another fun squat training day, trying to win that hypertrophy. Uh, so I ended up having eight sets of eight squats today. I forgot to film the first one, which is 495 for eight, but uh, I did them in a pyramid fashion: 495 for eight, 515 for eight, 535 for eight, 555 for eight, 555 for eight, 535 for eight, 515 for eight, 495 for eight. I get tired just saying it. And, uh, you know, my real goal with this hypertrophy little block of training, not that uh, I really need to add that much more size to my legs, as, uh, as you can tell here. Um, but, you know, the, the objective is to do as much work above 60% intensity as possible. Um, so it's about, you know, about a 800-pound high bar squat for me. And... Uh, so we're just trying to do as much work as possible, really over 480, um, up, you know, so 60 to 70 percent intensity, um, so just between 480 and 560, and uh, just continuing to do more and more and more, and the more volume I can handle, the closer I can get to my maximum recoverable volume in those ranges, the bigger muscles I'm going to get, and then uh, I take those bigger muscles and put them into a strength block and a peaking block and uh, teach them how to produce a lot of force and uh, hopefully become a great, great power lifter by doing that. So, uh, as you can see here, it's just doing more and more squats. So, uh, over the weekend, I was in Las Vegas coaching at USPA Nationals. Um, I had three athletes that I that I was working with there at the at the meet: um, T. Papula, Jake Johns, Kevin Torres, and uh, you know I think 99% of lifters out there would be ecstatic with the days they had, uh, but you know, we set the bar very, very high for uh, what we're considering a, a great weekend, and when uh, you set the, the barrier for greatness at you know, all-time total world records and, and you know, top five totals of all, of all time, regardless of weight class, uh, sometimes you don't come away with uh, you know, as happy as you possibly could be, but you know, there were good things all around um, for all the guys. 80-pound uh, total PR at 242s for T. Uh, he totaled 20.31. A 90-pound uh, total PR for uh, for Jake Johns. Jake Johns, big SC boy, totaled 21.54 with a big PR bench at 589. T also benched 537 at 242. And then uh, Kevin Torres went over 1650. Unfortunately, uh, didn't quite make uh, weight. You know, had a tough. Tough weight cut down from about in the low 180s down to 165. Wasn't quite able to make that, but uh, we'll be back. We'll be coming for the records, and uh, you know those those guys really work hard, and I'm I'm very proud of what they've done, and I'm looking forward to continuing to help them get even stronger. So uh, there you go, more squats. Enjoy them. Check out scientific principles of strength training, so you can learn how to design these different uh, hypertrophy strength and peaking blocks. For yourselves, and uh, I have really just this week left of the hypertrophy block. Then I'm going to get into two strength blocks and two peaking blocks as I prepare for Pro Raw 7 in Melbourne, Australia in November. And I will go uh, from there to travel all around Australia doing a series of clinics in uh, Melbourne, Brisbane, Sydney, and Perth. And then from Perth, we're going to head up to Moscow, Russia for the WRPF meet. I don't actually know what it's called, but uh, New Federation uh, run by Kirill Suryachev, the amazing bench presser, and all of your favorite, uh, you know, Russian beasts will be there, and I'll, uh, I'll be lifting as well. So it'll, it's going to be two, two meets in a three-week span. So working hard to get ready for those, you know, to showcase my talents on the world stage. Hopefully, uh, you know, represent well for America over there in Australia and Russia. And uh, just working as hard as I can to get ready for it. Thank you for watching.